Hearthorn, California. Yay, California. I am so excited to be submitting a video to you guys. And on that note, let me tell you what's going on. I'm a raging mess. Behind all of this niceness that you see right here, I'm stressed out. I'm freaking depressed on and off. I'm just thin. I'm thin. I have gray hairs. All because of this wedding. So, what's going on? We have a venue. We have, which is our wedding supposed to take place at the Century, oh God, at the Radisson LAX Hotel on Century Boulevard. I'm just ahead of myself. Help me. Help. Anyway, back to the subject at hand. Wedding. I'm going to be getting married to this gentleman named Stephen Justin Joseph. Wonderful guy. Good guy. But he's getting on my nerves. Borderline getting on my nerves. Please send me some help. I need another guy to help me out. The tag team. Mm -hmm. We don't have our rings. We have a theme with summer colors. The theme is an evening of love. And our summer colors are turquoise and yellow. Which that's for a daytime wedding. But I want a nighttime Shazam. And I just don't think it's going to work out well. That's where you come in, David. I really need your expertise because I am not a wedding planner. I'm just a bride who's trying to plan her wedding, if you get what I'm saying. What else do we have going on? Explain our wedding in three words. I'm stressed out. Did you get it? Good. What else? My daughter, 18 years old. This is a stressful situation. She's in the wedding. Not in the ceremony, but a part of the wedding. She went and got a tattoo. How great is that? Yay, Asia, for mom's wedding, right? Great. So we need to find somebody to cover this hideous tattoo for my wedding. I can't have her walking around like that. We've picked out dresses, we've picked out shoes, we've picked out uh, flowers, uh, we've picked out a photographer, a videographer, we got such a great deal, but I'm just in a frenzy. I'm vegan, Steve's a carnivore. My entire family, everybody eats meat. I don't eat meat. I don't like butter. I don't like milk. I don't like eggs. I don't like anything that we're serving at our wedding. That's not cool. So the bride won't be able to eat, basically. <laughs> Terrible. What else is there? Oh, my God. Let's breathe. Let's breathe. Let's think about it. Um... Steve selected a ring, but we haven't been able to purchase our rings as of yet. Uh, we still owe on our venue. We still just don't have things in line. I am unemployed currently. Steve's the only budget that we have working for us, so we're really pinching where we can. The dream wedding that I would really, really like to see is Coming to America. I don't know if you guys have seen that movie, but it's with Eddie Murphy. It's maybe 15 years old. They have this huge royal event for the Prince of Zamunda. And I think my family would enjoy, I know Steve and I would really enjoy an event that serves royalty, that's just catering, it's food everywhere, it's animals, it's outdoors, it's pretty, it's got lots of lighting, just lots of stuff going on. David to Tara. I'm Linda Sherman and I'm going to be a part of Chaton and Steve's wedding party. Uh, let's see, where can I begin? Uh, their wedding is expected to be in June. However, maybe about a year and a half ago, Chaton has been starting with her wedding plans and really just doing a number on her bridal party. So... <laughs> We've been to about five different stores for just dresses and maybe about three other stores for shoes and we just recently found a dress and a pair of shoes. However, there's still a whole lot more. We constantly get emails, we constantly get text messages, we have meetings here, there, and everywhere. And it's kind of interfering with my schedule, so I'm going to request and I mean really, really request with my whole heart, okay, that you come in and assist her. We love her. 
we want her wedding to be outstanding, but she needs a little, you know, a little assistance. So, from all of us to you, please help. We can no longer deal with this foolishness. <laughs> Thank you. Hi, David. My name is Heather, and I'm Shatan's cousin and a member of her bridal party. I just wanted to tell you about these lovely dresses that she selected for us. This is what we are going to be wearing down the aisle, and um, quite frankly, the dress is hideous. Um, I understand why she picked this dress, because it's so very similar to the way hers is made in the back and the, the, um, the front, the neckline. However, none of us are brave enough to stand up to Sergeant Shatan for fear that we might get the boot and kicked out of the wedding. So, that brings me to her dress. My cousin wants to wear this dress on her wedding day down the aisle. And it looks like a freaking nightgown. I just can't believe this. David, we really need your help because this dress does not say wedding. This is just too plain and too casual. So we need a dress that's going to be fabulous, elegant, sophisticated, maybe that classic old Hollywood style that really fits Shatana's personality. Hi, David. My name is Mia. First of all, let me just say that I love, love, love you. I watch your show every Sunday. I'm borderline in love with you. Um, but anyway, back to my sister's wedding. Um, my sister Shatan is getting married June 2nd of this year, and I am her maid of honor. Um, what can I say? Yes, she's been driving us absolutely crazy, actually, since August of last year. Um, we have constant emailing, telephone calls. It's just been a nightmare. I feel like I'm getting married, and I'm not. Anyway, um, we really, really, really need your help. My sister wants to do a Harlem Nights theme, but she's all over the place. Last week, it was coming to America. Now, today, it's uh, Harlem Nights. So, we really need your help. Um, the dresses, I don't have them here, but the dresses that she's picked for us are, they don't go with our body type. So, we really need your help as far as helping us with the dresses and just, I really just want my sister to have the best wedding possible, um, and she deserves it. So if you could really help us um, with your brilliant skills, we would really appreciate it. Um, hopefully talk to you soon. Bye. Hi, David. This is Stephen Joseph, the bride of, or well, the groom of the bride-to-be, uh, Shatana Anderson. I have the greatest uh, woman in the world and try to make my wife happy, but this wedding planning does not seem to work out. These are not my ideas of uh, centerpieces. I'm trying to find the quickest trash can I can find. If I could have the greatest uh, dream wedding I could find, initially I wanted an outdoor wedding, but someone didn't want to be too hot, didn't was worried about the weather during the summertime, so we've uh, decided on a venue at the Radisson Hotel LAX. And it's a great venue. I love the decision made with that as well. But we're going back and forth. I don't like the bridesmaids' dresses. They can't seem to match the colors up correctly. And I'm going to have a hard time trying to get my, uh, my groomsmen in uh, correct attire and trying to match. This black tie attire is not working with the dresses that I've seen. So uh, I'm stuck in the quicksand right now and I'm sinking fast. Please send me some help. I need another guy to help me out. The tag team with me. See you soon, David. Come help, please. Soon. So at this moment, I'm going to give you some silence so I can pray to the gods right now. David, if you're up there, I need your help. My bridal party needs your help. My mom needs your help. I need me, 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 me. I need, are you listening? Okay. I need your help. My wedding feels like a disaster and I don't know what's happening. If you have anything in you that wants to help a dreading bride, I'm your girl. I'm your girl. Thanks, David.